Hey, we're here at 500 Startups Demo Day in Mountain View, and we're here with Manolo, and he is the founder of Yogo Me. So tell us about your startup. We are developing mobile educational games for kids ages 4 to 10. Right now we have four games in the App Store. We started with iOS, but next is Android, obviously. And the cool, the cool is that we develop a story for the kids, so we have good guys and bad guys. So every game is based on a mission, which makes the games more exciting for the kids. The kids can travel in time, they can go to a space. So that makes learning more interesting and engaging for the kids. I think I would actually use this. It sounds like fun. So what is your market? Uh, right now we are starting in the US, but Asia, yeah, uh, it's like right now it's divided 40% the US, 40% Asia, and 20% Latin America. Uh, we are localized, we're about to start localizing the games for Asia. I mean, the biggest market is the US, obviously, but we really want to go after Asia as well. And for uh, the US market, we also have the games in Spanish because parents here in the US really care about their kids learning Spanish. And what better way than technology and with fun? and with games in the iPad. And so could, um, is, are the Spanish games for English speakers who want to learn Spanish, or are they for Spanish speakers who want to just uh, you know, play on the platform? Actually, it's for both, because they can play the game either in English or Spanish. And it's a great way for kids to start listening and watching another language. So Manolo, what made you realize that this is something that um, kids would want out there, and also parents? We started in, a, in another educational project in Mexico, but the, the approach was more about selling the tool to the school. And we think that that doesn't go with the kids, are, what, 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 uh, with the things that the kids are using. For them, another tool coming from the school is like, oh, it's boring, I have to use it because it's homework. And for us, that is not related to really what education and learning is all about. Learning has to be fun, it has to be engaging, so we really have to, uh, I don't know, like uh, convert the content into something that is interesting for, for the kid. That way is not something that the school is telling the kids to use, it's more about the kids us using something that they want and in the process they are learning and developing skills, which is the, like, even better. For, because the parents, I mean, if a kid is asking for another yoga me or another educational game, the parents are going to be great. I mean, my kid is trying to learn and practice math or languages or learn about recycling. It's really, really cool. The kids are the ones who are motivated to yeah. use it. So yeah, it's that is the idea, to really motivate the kids. I mean, I mean, they can play any game, any educational game on the iPad because the parents are telling them to use the iPad, but I mean, the iPad is great without even like turn off. I mean, it's really, really cool. But if you have the right content for the kids, it's, it makes a whole difference. So Manolo, how did you get here to 500 startups? You said you had another startup in Mexico, yes. but um, what did it take for you to present here and become part of this batch? Uh, we started in, in another incubator in Mexico, Mexican BC last year. And we had our demo day this year in San Francisco, and Dave McClure was there. Uh, he was uh, watching what we are doing. He really liked the approach that we are, are using for the games. So he just invited us, and we are he now here in this demo day, 500. And for us, it's really great because we really want to have a global product, not only for Mexico, not only for Latin America, to really connect the kids all around the world with these educational games. So are you looking to um, just have your headquarters here? Uh, we want to have an office here in terms of business development, but we are going to have the team, the production team in Mexico. It's way cheaper than, than, than here in the US, and the quality is the same. So we really want to have uh, the, the, the production team in Mexico and here the, the other office. And you have that ability to do it because you're ingrained in the, in the community there, right? Yes, yes. Actually, yes, the community is growing really, really fast. And just uh, this idea of working with a Silicon Valley compa company, it's great for the people in Mexico. So, and we're really happy to really like uh, coming here for the money and going back there and create jobs. For us, it's like really, really amazing. 
Yeah. Yes, that's awesome because there's a definitely a something greater and, and bigger than even just you know your startup, right? Yeah. So you guys are doing a great job, and we wish you all the luck. And if uh, they want to see more about oh, yeah. you know learn more, yeah. where do they, they go? Can go to yogami.com, and also they can look for our games at the App Store. We already have four games. Uh, we have uh, free uh, light versions, so they can try the games. And if they want to play more, they can just buy the full version of our games. Excellent. Well, thank you, Manolo. Thank you and good luck tomorrow. Thank you.